All right, so in Unreal, so we're going to start with the uh, ALS system. This is uh, free on the Epic Marketplace. This is just a basic game system. So if I hit play, I can run around. So this has already got a heap of animations and stuff in it. And so we're going to use this as a base. Instead of uh, mocap, basically, I will be using this as an animation source. Now, on top of that, we then have a camera here. As you can see, it's sort of jiggling a bit. And so what that is, is we're receiving the data just here from Opti the uh, motive it's called, is the software OptiTrack runs. And so as I pick this up and move it around and turn it and whatnot, we now have a camera in Unreal that is replicating the movements of this. Like that. So that's where it starts. Now I'm going to get my unpaid assistance help. Um, yes. All right, so what we're going to do with this uh, is we're quickly, we are going to remake National Treasures uh, because why not? So what we're going to do is we're going to combine both the camera and the character at once and I'm going to make do a bit of previs, um, you know, previs is helpful for film, it's helpful for animations, it's really helpful for everything. Um, and these are the sort of tools, you know, uh, Hugh had shown, they do um, a system we use for previs for cheese it so, um, you know, this is the same thing. So if I hit play, what I have here is, all right, so I have up in the left corner, and I'm going to make it bigger so you can see, I have somewhere here, I need to figure out where it's playing. Where is it playing? Can you please move into the camera view? Ah, oh, there we go. Alright, so I'm going to try my very hardest to do a um, camera move with a tiny little tracking marker while uh, my character here walks around the corner. And all this is happening live, you know? We're just using the Xbox controller. Alright. Just like that. And so, you know, that took me three seconds. You know, we're just using an Xbox controller. I could replace this with a phone or a Vive or something like that, a VR headset. Um, and then the beauty of Unreal is what we can do is we can use what's called Take Recorder. So Take Recorder lets us record uh, data, not video, but data. So what we're going to do is we're going to record the camera's position and the character's animation as it's created so that we can then play that back later and fine tune it. So I'm going to hit play, I'm going to hit record, I'm going to full screen, and we're going to try and make a scene here. Alrighty. Right, and then we hit escape. And so the beauty of Take Recorder is that we can then play that back. And so remember, we're not playing back the video. We didn't record a video. We recorded the data of what the characters are moving. So I can scrub through it, and here we can see our character here moving around back and forward. And this is all new animation, right? This isn't previous animation. We're, because Unreal's a game engine, we've blended various animations together. Uh, and we have our camera here that's been tracked. And so I can, you know, we've still got our track camera here. That's the track one. This gray one here is the previous camera that we did. And so I can come through and if I hit that and that, then we can actually watch back. I'll hide this camera. And I can actually watch back the thing we just made. So, and then I can come through here and here's the benefit is I can then start editing. It. So if I find the camera, I don't know where it there it is. You know, I can grab the camera and I could change the focal length, for example, if we say you want 50 mil, you know, I can add animation on top of this, I can change the focus, you know, and so we can fine tune this and then we've got pretty much a complete cinematic ready uh, to use for, you know, uh, the next step, you know, we can, you know, now we have uh, directions for actors, we have, we know what we need in an environment, you know, um, we know what camera moves we want, and so all this is pre-planned out, and we did that all in, you know, five minutes, ten minutes, uh, in front of you guys with nothing more than an Xbox controller, basically, and a tracking system. 
So hopefully you enjoyed that. I'm sure you probably have questions. So um, do feel free to ask them away in the chat. Uh, I believe we have some Q&A afterwards uh, to answer them.